And Emma is demonstrating one of this season's <laughs> trends. It's white, isn't it's it? It's white. I'm very brave this morning. I risked it all to come in here. There was a, I was saying to you earlier, there was a yeah. lady on the tube with a cup of coffee with no lid, <laughs> and it was a little bit dubious. I would be pushed right up against <laughs> it. I'm going to say, this would be an absolute nightmare for me, because I am one of those people who, within minutes of leaving the house, I I'm pretty filthy, and so dark <laughs> colours work best. Yeah. It is a hazard. It is a hazard, particularly around small children. Mm. Chocolate um, fingers. Chocolate fingers, straw, you know, any food that's likely to stain, strawberries, tomatoes, coffee, red wine. But I think the risks are worth it. Okay. Well, <laughs> Just we'll take go out it. with some vanish or something. We'll you? look at the looks then to yeah. see whether it's worth it. Because yeah. obviously it is big this year. It's big this year. To be fair, it is a classic. Yeah. Obviously, at, at this time of year. Now, um, it's very weather dependent. Obviously, we haven't had much of a summer at the moment, but it is, it's the perfect summer shade, mm. um, particularly if you are going on holiday to somewhere warm where there's some sunshine. But yeah, I'll show you a few ways. So we're starting off with culottes. I am demonstrating some culottes. Um, these are by Somerset uh, by Alice Templey, which is available with uh, John Lewis. It's like a diffusion line of her, so it's slightly cheaper. Um, we've teamed it with this really pretty frilled um, vest top from Zara. And we've kept the look very casual with some trainers, some Stan Smith trainers, just with a little bit of light pink going on there. So really relaxed, chilled look, um, perfect for sort of weekend dressing. The tennis trainers do remind me, we've just obviously seen Wimbledon. Yeah. Do you think that that kind of, obviously, white hues at Wimbledon, yeah. that does trigger this trend year on year? Totally. I was going to say, Wimbledon obviously is over, but traditionally we do associate wearing all white with that two weeks of the year yeah. <laughs> so yeah it's definitely you've got a very sporty vibe going yeah, on definitely. yeah definitely okay let's take a look at the next look um, and the next one is just very simply this dress from Topshop so it is off the shoulder I've been in a few times talking about off the shoulder tops and, and dresses so this demonstrates that perfectly We've got the lace detail um, as you can see just around the hem of the dress and across um, the shoulders as well just really again very relaxed summer dress um, that's been teamed there with wedges, but again, you could wear it with flat sandals or a pair of uh, like tennis shoes as well. So it's such a versatile dress. Yeah, and if you know it gets a little bit cooler in the evening, just pop a jacket just on top. A, and then... Like a, uh, a biker jacket, leather yeah. biker jacket would look perfect with that. So yeah, very I'm getting simple. it. I'm getting it. I'm totally getting there. there Andy. I am. You're totally there. Uh, let's look at the third look then. <laughs> uh, the third look is. Um, Shorts from Marks and Spencers. Uh, sorry, no, shorts are from Reese. Sorry, the jumper is from Marks and Spencers. Mm. That jumper um, is actually from their autumn winter collection, which is incredibly scary. But it's cotton. It's 100% cotton, so it's very lightweight. Perfect for a chillier summer evening or a chillier summer day. And we've teamed it with these um, shoes, which are from Kurt Geiger. I love these shoes. They've got like this studded detail. They actually look like pearls, but they're not. Um, so yeah, just like a, a thicker wedged, um, a thicker heeled um, shoe there so they're uh, a little bit more comfortable for you to wear in the day as and you well. can kind of get away with that can't you because you are going quite quite plain on top yeah. and so actually a little bit of detail elsewhere exactly works. and i was going to say actually when i'm saying we're looking at all white outfits that doesn't necessarily extend to the shoes so it can be nice to add a little bit of pop of color mm. on your feet uh, as well so. okay and the final look and the final look um this it's just a very, um, it's quite a romantic, pretty look. So the blouse is by Alice Templey, but this is her more expensive line. Um, it's this really pretty um, vintage lace. Um, and we've teamed it with white jeans from River Island and the sandals from Ancient Greek. Yeah, I mean, it, you definitely can see that kind of holiday feel to that. Yeah, it has got a real holiday vibe um, going on there. So, Got to ask, white yeah. jeans. Yeah. Obviously here, these are ladies' white jeans. Mm. What about men in white jeans? I've seen lots of celebs pictured in the magazines yeah. and male celebs wearing them. Is it, is it a look which is coming back? I, well, here's hoping not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not convinced. And um, I was saying to you earlier, white jeans, even for women, kind mm. of went through a really weird phase. They were very slony and we saw Liz Hurley in her classic white jeans all the time. So um, fashion wise, we fell out of love with them, but mm. they are back for women. For men, I don't know if it's just maybe a step too far. I mean, would you be? I'd, I'd, well, for, for purely the fact that within three it, minutes of getting yeah. you know, out of the house, I'd have kind of ice cream, chocolate, and probably <laughs> a coffee spilt down it. For me, it's probably best to avoid them. Yeah. But uh, yeah, okay, white, there we go, head to toe in white. Yeah. We've got and it just all. invest in some good uh, detergent to get any <laughs> stains off. <laughs> yeah, vanish and plenty of other options out there for you. <laughs> Emma Smith, as always, lovely to keep up to date with what's uh, on the, uh, the fashion market.